Good afternoon, and uh, here's a story that you may find interesting. It's yet another uh, capita paying out compensation to family of the woman who died after her benefits were cut. Of course, we all know the DWP contracts out the uh, services to Capita who then decide on, well, they don't make the final choice, but they do the paperwork and the meetings. And then they pass that on to the DWP who then make the ultimate decision. Here's the story, it's in uh, The Guardian and of course it, it is a typical story uh, Philip a day and it's been settled uh, a negligence claim with the DOP contractor Capita and it's been a substantial payout the young mother who took an overdose after a disability benefits were removed. Philippa Day is 27 or was 27, a single mother from Nottingham who had long-standing mental health issues. Unfortunately she died in hospital in October 2019, two months after taking an overdose. She had endured months of stress and anxiety after a long struggle with the DWP and Capita to reinstate her benefits. An inquest uh, decided that, that there were 28 instances where systemic errors by both the DWP and the uh, Capita led to failures in the handling of her claim. They were obviously a stressor in, the, in her decision to end her life and the coroner ruled although he was unable to conclude she had intended to take her own life. In May the uh, family issued a compensation claim for negligence and the latter subsequently settled out of court. The sum was not disclosed but it's understood that it was in line with what the family were asking for. This money would then be used for the, for the lady's son. Imogen, her sister, had said that our family had always maintained that my sister's treatment by Capita on behalf of the DWP directly impacted her mental state and in the end is the reason for her death. Capita's wall of bureaucracy with no consideration for her Philippa's mental state exacerbated her despair at her debt and poverty. She was met with cold, uncaring call operators who would not listen to her calls for, for help. It is, of course, believed to be the first time that an agent of the DWP has settled a legal claim brought as a result of their errors. Capita... Uh, they're under contract to the DWP, had also agreed to meet the family to discuss ways to improve its interactions. A DWP spokesperson said in a statement, our condolences remain with the Day family. We cannot comment on active legal proceedings. It is not clear to which legal proceedings they refer to as Lee Day, solicitors, has confirmed Capita's settlement means no further legal action is outstanding. So good news for the family, but obviously that's another life lost to the DWP and the uncaring, unsympathetic system that if you have a mental health issue, you don't really get any help much at all, if at all. And of course, uh, once you uh, have your money re removed, uh, it could be any reason at all, uh, they obviously then you spiral down into debt. And uh, 
the anxiety of that can obviously push you over the edge. There we go. I hope you enjoyed today's story. And of course, don't forget to uh, like and share and uh, subscribe to the various channels we have, which are Odyssey, Brand YouTube, YouTube, and of course the Facebook page, Talking Really. You can of course go on to the website at www.talkingreally.co.uk and sign up for a membership to help out the channel. Thanks for watching.